mentioned collections. Now let me show you what a collection actually is. Um, when you make um, web pages within my portfolio, those pages are each independent of each other. So let's go and have a look at my pages. Now to do that, I can click on create or I can use the hamburger menu here and go to create. Both lead to the same place and look at the pages that I've got. Now here, as you can see, I have multiple pages. And what I want to do here is to make a collection and put pages together. So to do that, rather than making a page, I'm going to click add a collection. And I'm going to call it a collection. I might give it a bit of description. And then I'm going to edit the collection pages. So now what Mahara offers me are all the available pages that I have. Now I can literally just drag and drop these from pages into collection. And I can order them using the arrows. So let's just show you how that works very quick very quick just in a click and from that i'm then going to say done and you can see here my collection and my collection has three pages in it so now in my area where all pages and collections that belong to me are available there's my collection if i click there it tells me which pages i've got in it if i click on it it will open my collection. Now at the top here, can you see you've got a drop down? So that enables me to move between pages of the collection, or I can just use the arrow keys to move from one page to another. So there were three pages in total, and these are now all visible. And of course, I can then go back in and edit those pages, or I can even edit the collection. So here I've just got a page edit. That's fine. I can um, add additional things perhaps and continue to tweak. If I go back to pages and collections, I can also edit the collection by clicking on the drop down here and clicking edit. And now I might decide that I want to put different pages in perhaps. And from here I can. Uh, start to do that and revise my collection. Maybe give it another name. We'll click manage and rearrange page order or take a page out. And now you see that when I click done and go back to pages and collections, I've only got two pages in my collection.